In this video, I want to take a look at Jaheim Otis, a super highly talented player coming out of high school. Dropped a lot of weight, came in over 400 pounds and really a physical specimen. Uh, really quick for his size, very popular player that was requested for us to cover a video on. So I want to take a look in particular at the Arkansas game last year because he had a one of his best games of the season and he started at nose tackle and had a pretty prominent role in that game. So you can see here he's at nose tackle on the second play of the game for the defense. And he takes on a double team. This is a common theme in this game. Uh, you're going to take on double teams as a nose tackle, but he holds up pretty well here. I mean, this is all you can expect for a nose tackle to take on double teams. And this is a freshman here, so uh, really a good look here. Here he is one-on-one, -on -one, and you see what happens when he gets matched up one-on-one -on -one at the point of attack. He holds up very well, clogs and makes plays. Uh, next play here. Again, he's taken on a double team here, but still holds up very well. Really clogs everything. That run goes nowhere. It's exactly what this defense needs. Uh, here you can see his pursuit. You'll see the replay here. But he holds down the fort, and then when the run's coming at him, he's got the ability to get off and make the play. So that's really what you like to see out of a big guy. And they're focused on Will Anderson and the edge guys. They get all the credit in this game, and, and they're focused on them. But you can see Otis here comes in, helps clean up the play, shuts it down. Now, next play here, Otis at the top of the screen, one-on-one. -on -one. He just plows through, bull rushes, makes the sack. Uh, Will Anderson cleans it up, so, you know, they're going to be focused on him. But Otis makes the play here phenomenal. Next play, I want to show this one. Running back goes right through Otis. You know, I'll show the good and the bad. You can't make all the plays. Uh, next play here, this is a good run by the back, but I really want to show the replay here. You've got Otis right where the back goes through, taking on a double team, and then he spins out of it. I mean, that's all you can ask out of your big guy. That's not his fault that the run is successful. And then here he is, one-on-one. -on -one, you can see he just blows this play up. Uh, they're running a zone left, and he just gets in there and blows it up, which is very impressed with his quickness and his size. Uh, next play here, again, he's kind of flowing out with the play, just shuts it down, run goes nowhere. And they rotated him a lot in this game with DJ Dale, so he didn't play but probably half the snaps roughly. So he was fresh a lot of the game. Uh, but you can see head up here, uh, comes off, it makes a sack again, so, you know, he's everywhere. He doesn't give up. For someone of his size, he's not just a, a Terrence Cody that's going to clog and stand there. He's got the quickness to move. He's slated to start at nose tackle. That's kind of obvious. There's not really anybody, I think, that would unseat him. He'll be the guy, and just being a sophomore this year, I think his upside is enormous, and continue to watch and see how he improves. He definitely could be one of the stars of this defense, uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe.